all new for 2020, the folks over at HHA Sports have completely redesigned and reintroduced the Tetra line. There are four different models in this line that we're going to show you today, starting with the Tetra Max. So the Tetra Max, as you can see here, is available in a fixed configuration. We've got three different mounting holes to choose where you want to mount it onto your site. It's also available in a tournament edition with a dovetail. So if you want to get a little bit of extra distance out in front of your riser, they also have a, a dovetail version. Uh, we're taking a look at the fixed version today. Like all HHA sites, it is adjustable. That is kind of the hallmark of the HHA product. So this is a single pin site right here that we're looking at. All new for this year, we've got this infinitely adjustable elevation on the scope housing up front. Previous models of the HHA, if you look back to the Kingpin or the Optimizer series, uh, they had a couple screws in here and you had to actually unscrew the scope and move it up or down. You don't have to do that anymore. You simply loosen it. You can move it right here within the housing. So that is a new feature for this year. Also, as you guys can see, looking down the scope, we've got an all new larger sized green sight ring. Uh, with an integrated level system right into it. So this is going to be the Tetra Max. One other feature we should tell you about with the Tetra Max, very similar to what the Kingpin had in years past, it's got a removable wheel. And the nice thing about that is if you're shooting multiple arrow setups of different weights, you can actually remove the wheel, put a new wheel on once it's calibrated for your weight, and you can switch between arrow setups without having to put a new sight tape or re-sight in your bow. So that's going to be the Tetra Max. It's going to be the highest end sight in the Tetra line. Next up, we're going to show you guys the standard Tetra. Now this site was actually released uh, about a year ago. It's got an updated sight ring and level system. Uh, other than that, this Tetra remains relatively unchanged from previous versions. We also have a Tetra LT. So this is gonna be a slider sight. So this is gonna be the replacement for like the Optimizer Lite, uh, if you guys have seen that site over the years. So all new redesigned frame, new infinitely adjustable front end, just like the Tetra and the Tetra Max has. It's got the updated sight ring and level system. So this is an all new ground up uh, product from HHA for this year. It's gonna be a little bit lower price point than the Tetra and the Tetra Max, uh, which is just a great site. You know, honestly for anybody, it doesn't matter what price point it's at. It's a really, really nice site. Uh, we're looking at it today. It's got an optional quiver mount here. Uh, so this does not come standard. Uh, if you need this and you want an additional quiver mounting location, this bracket is nice and easy, just bolts on with one screw, allows you to put a quiver on your bow with ease. So that is the Tetra LT. And the last one we're gonna show you here, we've got a Tetra LT with a four pin head. Now all of the sites we just looked at, the Tetra Max, the Tetra, the Tetra LT, are available with the standard single pin, which is really what HHA is known for, but they've also got a new four pin housing as well. Uh, so if you wanna do like a 20, 30, 40, 50 yard pins, and then you use your bottom one as the adjustable floater, get you some extra distance, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 yards. Uh, hopefully you're just shooting targets and not animals at that distance. So that's just my personal preference. But uh, yeah, we've got a new four pin configuration from HHA as well in the Tetra line. So if you guys are in the market for a new site, uh, you're buying a new bow and you want to outfit it or you're looking for an upgrade from some of your old stuff, make sure you check out the all new Tetra line from HHA Sports.